On average, everyone grows about a half an inch of hair every month. Although genetic factors can contribute to individual differences, it is not as significant as we think. There is no proven scientific formula to accelerate or stimulate hair growth. What you see on YouTube telling anyone that they can make their hair longer by 3 to 4 inches in only a few weeks is misleading. Anyone who seems to have their hair grown faster is just because their hair has thicker texture and grows in higher density. When your hair becomes thicker and denser, it will look longer too. Here I have 10 suggestions to treat your hair in the proper way and get the essential nutrients for healthy hair growth. Make sure to subscribe for more great content like this. Number 1. Massage your scalp. Massaging your scalp can improve the blood circulation in your head and stimulate the activity of your hair follicles. When more of your follicles become active, you can grow more hair and thus your hair looks longer. Here are two ways you can do it. Rubbing your scalp with essential oil, or the inversion method that is recommended by many beauty bloggers. Directions of essential oil massage. Prepare either one of these essential oils, peppermint, tea tree oil or lemon oil. Warm up the oil you prepare. Massage your scalp with the oil for 20 minutes. Leave the oil in your hair for another 30 minutes. Rinse out the oil in the end. Directions of inversion method. Sit on a chair and flip your hair over so your head is positioned under your heart. Massage your scalp with your fingertips for 5 minutes. Rub the front, back and sides of your scalp in circular motion. Number 2. Trim your ends regularly. This may sound counterintuitive at the first glance. But it's crucial to ensure that your hair grows healthily. When the ends of your hair splits, they will entangle each other and finally die off. Cutting a little part of your hair can make your hair healthier in the long term. For how much to be taken off, it depends on how your split ends looks like. This video will tell you what to pay attention to when trimming your ends. Number 3. Use conditioner more often than shampoo. Many of us shampoo our hair when we shower, thinking that washing away dirt is good for our hair. But shampoo also takes away the natural oils on our head which is essential to keep our hair soft. Our hair will then become drier and weaker. It's best to limit the use of shampoo to no more than twice a week. Use conditioner whenever you wash your hair. Conditioner helps repair the damaged particles in your hair and keep it strong. Number 4. Apply egg mask treatment at least once a month. Eggs can benefit your hair growth a lot as they contain abundant protein which helps strengthen hair follicles. The rich moisture in the hair mask can protect the hair from becoming dry and thin. Directions. Crack an egg into a bowl and whisk it until it becomes smooth. Pour in the yogurt and whisk it with the egg until the mixture becomes creamy. Apply it to your wet hair for 20 minutes. Wash your hair to rinse out the mask. Number 5. Don't put your hair in a bun too often. Don't have a hair bun too often, or make it too tight when you tie up your hair. Over time structural damage to your hair will cause the fragile strands will break. Even if you're not especially fond of this hairstyle, you may like wrapping your hair in your bath towel after your shower. This is as damaging as making a hair bun because your hair will get entangled. When you brush your hair, the fragile strands will be more prone to breaking as well. Number 6. Take Omega-3 Fatty Acids. Omega-3 fatty acids have anti-inflammatory properties. They prevent inflammation of the hair follicles, which is a common cause of hair loss. Omega-3 fats also protect the cells in the body and keep your scalp healthy. To reap the benefits of omega-3 fats, eat fatty fish such as salmon, herring, or anchovies twice a week. If you're not a fan of fish, you can also take fish oil capsules. Number 7. Get more protein. Proteins are the essential building blocks of hair. Eating enough protein is important to maintaining a high replacement rate of hair. Otherwise, you will begin losing hair faster than it is replaced, making hair loss more noticeable. Meat, poultry, fish and seafood are all good sources of protein. But if you're a vegetarian, you can incorporate whole grains, beans, nuts and seeds into your diet to get enough protein. Number 8. Boost Vitamins A and C Intake. Vitamin C helps your hair stay moisturized and protects it from breakage. 
Its antioxidant property also protects your hair from damage caused by free radicals. Both vitamins A and C are responsible for protecting and repairing bodily tissues, including hair tissues. Foods such as dark leafy greens, liver, eggs, and dairy are rich in vitamin A. You can easily get vitamin C from fresh fruit and vegetables, such as berries, kiwi, tomatoes. So don't forget your 5 a day. Number 9. Get some biotin. Biotin is a form of vitamin B. In rare cases of biotin deficiency, hair loss may be a problem. While available in capsules, biotin is also found in foods such as soybeans, beef liver, and butter. Number 10. Drink more water. Staying hydrated is important to hair health. Severe dehydration can stop hair growth, and dry hair tends to break more easily. Drinking enough water can keep hair cells healthy. Keeping your body hydrated is easy, just drink enough water every day. But there are tricks to keep your hair hydrated, such as blow drying your hair less often and at a lower heat setting, and avoiding hair products that contain silicones and sulfates. Thanks for watching.